No aspect of black Americans' quest for justice and equality under the law has been nobler than what has been called the fight for the right to fight. Our commemoration today of the racial integration of the armed forces makes us reflect on how far we have come toward living up to our founding ideals, and yet how much remains to be done. We know from our preamble that all men were created equal, but this was not the belief adhered to in the United States military in World War II. A couple of months after graduating high school in 1942, I enlisted in the Army. I was assigned to the 92nd Infantry, the Buffalo Division. Our division was trained at four different locations because at that time in our history, no congressional delegation in the United States would allow 15,000 armed black men the size of an infantry unit to be trained in their state. Our division produced about 3,000 casualties in Italy. We have two Medal of Honor winners, but here I stand today in our capital's rotunda. And I look back and remember those days that went, and those men who went before me, and some of them still lie in graves in Italy. The only question I have, what took us so long, America, to live up to our creed? Thank you.